Oh yeah, baby, pressure reducer. This is another pressure reducing valve video. If you guys don't like it, don't have to watch it, baby. If you do like them, leave a like. So right now what we're gonna do is uh, unsweat this old pressure reducing valve. I did try to unthread it, but uh, it wasn't working, baby. It's a little too uh, naughty in there. So we're gonna basically get rid of all this stuff here. We're gonna keep this Street 45. Um, why didn't you uh, take off that gates valve and replace that for the customer? I did offer to put a new ball valve in there, but uh, the customer, I mean, you guys are in service. You can't, you can't make everybody happy, okay? So I did offer to do that. They didn't want to deal with it. They said, well, I have this one above it. It works fine. I'm like, yeah, it works fine. They were like, okay, well, why do I have to replace this? And I was like, I mean, hey, do what you want to do. It's your house, baby. So, uh, yeah, they denied that, but we're going to still do the pressure reducing valve because that one was ancient. It was probably about 30 or 40 years old. So we're going to swap this Jimmy John out right here, baby. Add the Teflon and dope to the threads because I know you guys in the comments always want to beef with me about the you should have just used Teflon. You should have just used dope. I use both because I'm a gangster. So we're going to slap this guy back together. Um, cut this down a little bit so it fits. And then, uh, yeah. You should have used your level. You should have used your tape measure. I go by the eyes, baby. I'm a hog out this. Bra! But yeah, we're going to tighten everything up. Test everything. Get this all nice and tight. Test this. I forgot that I drained that out to get the remaining water out from unsweating. And yeah, it's good to go. New pressure reducer, baby.